Ben, not so today I'm going to be reacting to a video Swift put out earlier today called Goodbye Mick Jugger Nuggets. And um, I'm really looking forward to watching this, uh, especially because yesterday Swift had put out a little Twitter video um, explaining that he was editing this video and was already crying. And that little Twitter video made me cry. Well, it gave me tears. I didn't really cry. I just had some tears. Um, so I know I'm going to be crying in this one, especially because I don't want to see him go. And this is going to be like a compilation and like, it's just going to like, oh, the feelings are going to come. Oh, but I'm like looking forward to it because I love to feel things. Even if it's stuff like this, I just love to feel things. Um, and also I want to say really quick, um, before I get started is I want to thank Jesse for watching my reaction video. And also thank you so much, Jesse, for showing uh, Swift the reaction video and um, Swift said some really kind words to me um, in the DMs after watching the reaction video and um, so thank you so much Jesse for for showing him Jesse like you're a genuine guy you know I love you and I just you guys are all so amazing like you Swift like so many people in the Jargon Nuggets universe are like so amazing and I know Jesse in particular is like an amazing person very genuine um, himself and is just a good friend a good guy and it's just I love you Jesse <laughs> so um, anyways I just wanted to kind of say that out there because like you know like I Jesse watching my reaction and then him showing it to someone else is like amazing to me like most youtubers would not do that for reactors and um that I guess that makes me really feel that we are friends and that um you know like you would do that for me and I think that's really awesome I love you Jesse <laughs> anyway okay let's just get on with it oh my god I'm already like getting all sappy all right let's let's go <laughs> family how are you guys doing today i hope you're having a fantastic day the... got a smile on your face and you're ready for a brand new yeah, video swept. if you're not yet a part of the sex sex like family do me a favor smash that subscribe regenus guys do that too Ugh. subscribe button turn on post notifications to never miss out on any videos coming here to the channel as you guys see i am currently on my way into my car got to put my good old backpack in there and uh oh, what are, this is it was his last day down the south jersey i'm leaving my parents for most of the night tonight i guess you can say as i'm driving down south for my last day of working for rigid studios and to be 100 percent honest it's kind of weird to say that in the last year and a half i got to make a lot of great friends make a lot of great memories and do a lot of cool things and today is my official last day time to uh put the seatbelt on because i gotta start making the hour and a half drive down oh, yeah. to South Jersey for one last time. The funny thing is back in like 2016 or 2017, I don't remember saying this, but Jesse remembers it. And uh, I told him one day I was going to be his cameraman. And to have that opportunity to work for your favorite YouTuber, I, I have to say it was a great experience. But in life, as one chapter closes, a new one begins. And for Jesse, I would like to say thank you for everything, man, that you've ever done for me. All right, time to start the car. This is uh, gonna be the last time I have to make the drive. Well, you take a look at that. Oh, it's gonna be the last time we're gonna go see him again. Come on, it's like they'll never see each other again. I need to get some gas. I think while getting gas, I'm gonna slap a monster and also get a gallon of water. Mm. Hey, how you doing, man? Fill up the regular, please. Sure thing. Thank oh you. my gosh, that self service is so weird. So, it's the only, only time I've ever had, uh, oh, it's not self serve. The only time I ever had someone pump the gas for me was when I go to New Jersey. That's the only time, and I, like, don't know what to do. Because <laughs> it's like I get, because, like, we usually want to go to a gas station. And I pull up, I get my car, and I, like, do it as fast as I can because I hate pumping gas. It's, like, the most annoying thing. And then, like, I put it in, and, like, I go back in my car and sit down. I, like, let it, I just fill it up, and then I come and, you know, I, d I self serve, huh? Um, so, like, whenever. <laughs> So when I pull to a gas station, I'm always like, oh, because I usually don't see anyone around, you know. It's like, well, do they know I'm here? Like, cause I know I drive over those things, so I don't know, like, uh, are they, like, on their phone or something? Like, I don't have time to waste. I got, I got things to do. Huh? So, like, I always, like, pull up, and then I'm always like, is there someone, like, what do I do? Like, should I get out? Should I roll my window down? Should I honk my horn? Like, what do I do? So, like, I, I open my door. And then all of a sudden, someone's there. Someone's there. And then they're like, oh, how much? And I'm like, ah, you know, like regular. I don't know. Like, just fill it up. Uh, here's my card or, oh. yeah, it's like, it's like, it's so awkward. And I'm always like, I've never really, I really don't do this. 
Uh, so, like, uh, I'm not from here. Huh? I'm, like, so stupid. <laughs> Oh, well, it's see, okay. We got the monster, gallon of water, and the car yeah. itself is now done getting gas. To be honest with all of you, it's kind of bittersweet right now. Uh, it's just bitter. It's not sweet. Down the driveway, it's not sweet at all. Knowing this is the last time I'll be actually pulling down the driveway. I'm going to put my camera down not for now and Stop just it. enjoy my last night. So you're cool if I actually just pop off some stuff? Yeah. Well, guys, it's... uh. Kind of bittersweet this will be my last time in the rigid house at least as an employee right yeah as an employee maybe we can hang out never sometime. say never swift <laughs> mm, right back in three years guys. yeah three years <laughs> One? corn three months three uh, that's a little too soon and plantain i saw ooh, plantain oh yeah plantain chips oh those are good wow i didn't know they sold those up north anyway um so i wonder if this is after um all that was shot uh, what what is it? You ever had that before? Potato no. chips. Are yeah, you want know what this actually looks like? When you go to church and like they stick that after you make your like your communion or whatever. Yeah, you're eating the body of Christ. Yeah, that's. Kind of. Christ tasted better in all honestly. Really? It's yeah. plantain. saying it's like a banana, but it turned into a chip. But I see. Uh, but I when I lived in Florida, I used to buy plantains because they're like so cheap because plantains grow like in South America, so like. That's something I learned from Leo is to buy like plantain. So I would actually buy plantain at Walmart and then I would like make it as like a potato, I guess, with eggs and stuff. And it was like so good. I miss plantains. Huh? Pop chips. Yeah, dude. Hooked you up. You're leaving at the worst time, bro. We had to. I mean, dude, I'll just yeah, a store. Mm -hmm. huh? nah, what do you want? You're gonna be mad at me if I actually stole some of his bags. Cause how he... you feel, bro? Honestly, it's kind of bittersweet, actually. Let's see. Oh, I'm eating. It makes me feel better. I'm sorry. I, I think that. Mm -hmm. It sucks, you know, Tony kind of doesn't have a pop out. Dude, once Sony cameras add that, I think you should make the switch. Like, you're leaving, you're a cameraman, you're leaving. Are you talking about cameras, dude? Are you sure I, about this? Oh, well, yeah, man. <laughs> Alright, what's it all about? <laughs> we talked about this several times. A hundred times, a hundred mm -hmm. times. Well, at least, yeah. And to be honest, guys, it, it's bittersweet because well, I, wonder I care a lot I about him and he cares a lot about me. And, like, we, we just shot the finale okay, so of so. my departure. And if you haven't seen sit it. Down. Yeah, if you haven't seen it, I'm going to be linking that. And then I'm also going to be linking the sit-down video, which should have already came out at least three hours ago. Oh, um, yeah. I haven't watched any of the other videos. Like, I wanted to watch this first, but I haven't watched the sit-down video or anything yet. Um, so I really want to watch this first, and then I'm going to watch it after this. Your channel here. And... Uh, Damn, it's kind of, it's bittersweet and I'm not hitting you yet, Swift, huh? It's a little weird. Yeah, right. It's not going to pro it's not gonna process at all. Because, um, like, not many people could say they worked for their favorite YouTuber. Like, that. Whoa. That, that is weird. Like, we, we were just talking about so much because, like, I was telling you guys earlier, like, I've got, because he told me, apparently I texted him one day that I was going to be his cameraman. Parker was working for me, and I, we did a video where Isaac was going to, uh, this, Channel was done. I'm leaving for LA or something. Swift texts me. He's like, yo, you wow. can find all that stuff. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, no, like, it's fake. Like, Parker's working for me still. And I was like, Swift was like, well, I'll work for you at some point. I yeah, like, so I think I even said I would work wow. for you for free or something like that. And <laughs> now like, you're leaving. <laughs> yeah, it's after we, we did MVE and yeah, like, bro, you, like, you killed that series, man. Come here, man. You really did. Nothing. I was, dude, I didn't think you could do it. I mean, there was times where I was like, Swift, like. Yeah. You're like, not going to be able to do the fight scene. Are like, you going to be able to film Judgment Day? I'm like, I'll get to that. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> I remember there was a few for, a few episodes, or even in season two, where I was like, we're, we're screwed. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, you're never, you're never going to be able to shoot that fight how scene. About, how about the season uh, three, the opening, the first episode of season three? Oh, yeah, where like I was jumping over tables and running from... from it was like you and John Haggerty and I was like, dude, Malachi. if you can't get me jumping over a table, how the heck are you going to get the final? And then he did. And then got epic the drone shots in Hawaii. Dude, no, nothing, in my opinion, beats MVE what we did. Like, Yeah, dude. It just... I'm I'm sad but also excited for the future. Like, you know, one chapter will close and a new one will begin and I know it's a new chapter for me in my life and also same with you. And by the way guys, congrats to him. He just at at the recording right now hit a hundred K 
Thank you, bro. On Storyfire. Are you gonna be uploading the Storyfire? What do you do? You know you have like forty thousand active subscribers, I know, and you know I notifications know. go you know, out, you and know, you know like, you make more money on you, Storyfire. You know, like though, I don't, right? I don't have um, the access, to, you know, to actually upload on Storyfire. So. Do, do you want it? Because like you understand, Aww, it's five to six hours gift. CPM consistently. I mean, if, if I'm like able, you're gonna, if I'm actually able to post on Storyfire, I will. Like do I'll you come, post everything to Storyfire on YouTube? I'll come up with some creative for Storyfire. For real? Then, and then just vlogs, yeah. Like actual creativity wise. Alright, yeah, yeah. I yeah. could actually sit there and brainstorm trust something. Trust me, you want to be in on this stuff. Because, and... guys, I just did a film festival the other day, judging it, uh, posted on Twitter, didn't vlog anything, went back to my high school, and there's like some things, like during one of the uh, films, I was like, you know. I really want to create like a mini film again, like I did oh. back in high school, in a way. But it was like, how the heck am I gonna do that? I like that. <laughs> here, let me put you on that vlog. What do you want? Yeah, here, <laughs> let me, let me. So, <laughs> Swift's leaving. So funny. It sucks. It, it sucks yeah. between all of us. So it's bad cameraman. Wait, what? I agree. Yeah. I agree. I well, I mean, Parker's not even in the running. <laughs> what about, <laughs> um, about uh, the guy that kind of and corn um, that's. Well, not corn, the other guy that. Oh, Dom. Yeah. Well, I wouldn't even count that, but like as far as like that's right, basically about Swift versus corn. Swift shot MBE, which believe it or not, guys, I'm more proud of my virtual skate yeah, but no, as a no. storyteller than the Psycho well, series. It's harder. Like, I'll it's... always like the Psycho series is big, but as far as the format goes, I like the cinematic format more than vlog format. So like Swift, Swift's the best cameraman. It is. It sucks. That. We're trying not to get all like emotional <laughs> and stuff because we kind of did that a little bit in, the, in camera, the room there. Yeah, I you mean, want us to recreate aww. that because like I could probably you know, get emotional if I wanted is, to. We talked the, the thing that helped fuel MBE was a lot from my own personal depression. Um, there's just stuff that I've dealt with that I don't like opening up and talking about I've, I've seen have you things. done that at all on your channel i know you talked about mm. your dad and stuff but my like... dad but but there's scenes i've seen like you know failing cpr um on loved ones that for me is always going to be rough even though like you and me both believe a lot in lucid dreaming and all that and to have that loved one come back to you later that night in a dream and thank you for trying your best even though they weren't coming back um it sucks wow. but it's also kind of like there's something after this life there's just a lot of pain and hurt I've gone through, and uh, for a lot of the emotional stuff in MVE, I would have to go to dark places to help Isaac cry. And that, and that was kind of one of the best values to, to Swift, was that he would always have his heart in what he's doing, and that's something the other cameraman didn't have. Like, I feel like Swift had much more of an emotional maturity than most, so he was able to tap more into scenes have that intuition and yeah without like swift was the perfect person to film my virtual escape because where it's emotionally open yeah and it was it was a story about loss it yeah. was about grief it was i don't know if you guys know anything about myers-briggs so i'm like obsessed with that it's like a personality uh theory i think i i guess i used to think that swift was like esf if you guys don't know what this what that is they you can just ignore me here huh but i used to think he was like esfp or no J. But now I'm kind of thinking he's ENFJ. I mean, because you just said intuitive. He's like, you know, he's pretty intuitive. And he's able to tap it into his his feelings and stuff. Which SFs are able to do that too. But I guess, like, I don't know, with, with him being so genuine um, and, you know, so faithful and loyal and, like, a really good match for Jesse, which Jesse has said, like, he's an I. INTJ or ENTJ, I think more INTJ, huh? My opinion. Um, I think like two N's working together, that's like the best combination, like N T and F. Those are the two best combinations. Like they complement each other. Um, Swift compliments Jesse, Jesse compliments Swift, and the F always looks up to the T. Um, that's just how we naturally are. And, you know, feelers look up to thinkers, you know, and that's just you know, that's just how we are naturally. And I think that they were like an awesome combination and they were really, they, they connected on a lot of deep things because they're both N. So it's like, they think intuitively the same way. And so, um, that's why I think like Jesse probably thinks he's the best cameraman, not because he's N, that's not why he's saying it. Huh? Well, he's not talking about Myers-Briggs at all ever, but 
But, like, I think, like, that's why deep down, like, that's why. Um... Sorry about that. My dog was, like, barking at something. I don't know what. Freaking herself out. <laughs> like, there was nothing out there. Psycho. Anyway. Let's just keep going. <laughs> it's a very personal story. About the hurt and... It, I remember, um, you know, because it, it was hard working with your dad in, in MBE. Mm. There was a, we were in Jeffrey's office, which was Eve's bedroom, mm. and I had to make you cry, but also had to make your dad cry, which he did not want to oh, do. He didn't want not to do that. Angry. And I asked him, I said, Jeff, oh. how how did you react when both your parents passed away? And it was the most awkward thing because, um, <laughs> yeah. He's like, they're both alive. Yeah, you know? it was. Oh, yeah, I, I felt wow. bad for that one. Swift. Because, you know, when you lose a parent. Meg, stop. Lay down. Thank you. Now my dog is pushing her food bowl around for no reason. Yeah. At a young age, it kind of. Just it. it hurts. It, oh. it, it sucks. It hurts. And leaves a lot of emotion in you. And. So I was like, maybe I can trigger that with him. And, and, and to bring just, that into I can't make you the head. right now, what I told Swift was like basically to make sure he keeps his head up because, you know, it's hard, you know, carrying those yeah. demons or those, you know, ghosts inside your head and those tr tragic and traumatic experiences. And it, it, it messes with you. Especially as an artist, if you're somebody who likes to express himself in creative ways. When you're thinking of creative, imagine you end up going back there. Yeah. Mm, and most people, okay. they, that's what, you know, they're not so flexing that it. part too often. But for you, when you're done, and that's like, what, like, promise me, bro, when you're back home and like, you're watching this video or like, you know, things are getting hard while you're fighting fires or you're with your family and stuff is like, yeah, it's great that you're with your family, but you're also where all the hurt was too. Yeah. So just promise me that make sure that you keep your head up. And, and you keep grinding. Uh, yeah, I, I can I can promise you that. And the one thing is though too, I'm more aware of it than I was then, in many ways. And like it, sometimes it's a cycle, but I was able to learn how to catch the cycle and kind of prevent it in ways. And I feel like at times, honestly, mm -hmm. you guys, I put on a fake face when vlogging. I, I've seen people say, "Yeah, I, I'll oh, it. really?" Like, oh. it, but it, sometimes it's I'm not being able to be real. In many ways and going forward it's something I want to do like if I'm having a sh mm -hmm. don't want to say that word shapoopy shapoopy day <laughs> and I'm videoing myself I want you guys to see the real authentic me oh, instead of like, like everyone always says that I want to show you the real me huh <laughs> I guess that's like easier said than done <laughs> is this a real authentic you no. yeah right now it as is as close as we're gonna get yeah because right. right, nobody's the real them especially when a camera's on them like, cause tell you, them, tell them that. Yeah, well, <laughs> I mean, it's true. Like, you're not. Y'all don't get. It. I mean, there, there are those that get it, but they, yeah, there's like... people out there that do create and understand. Like, once the camera's on you, everybody's tone kind of shifts. But even to... when you get it, even like for me, even though I get it, I watch other YouTubers and I'm like, dude, like I still see. That's all you see. Yeah. It's like I still see them. Like yeah. if you watch whoever's videos, you're gonna still see them as whoever, whatever they display. So yeah, right. Like, uh, for me, right. like, another creator I love. And we were just talking about one of their videos because you didn't get to see it yet. Mm -hmm. Casey and I sat. I was like, you see only a certain side to people. And for me, I want to start being able to show all sides, whether I'm having a good day, a bad day, or just however the day is going. And like the one reason why I always start the vlog off like, hey, oh, good morning. I hope you're having a, sm or a fantastic day. A smile on your face is because even if I'm having a bad day, I want you to have a better day than me. Nice. That's... That's literally so like my big thing. Like, even if I'm having a bad day, I want you to have a good day. Like as you guys saw a few weeks ago, or something like that, when a police officer pulled over and we had a conversation off, um, off camera, he was talking about to me about how he loves the intro because when he's at work and he's watching one of the videos, it makes him in a better mood. And I could be going having oh, the worst day of my life, officer? but knowing oh, as long as videos. one of you guys have a better day after that, that's. That's what matters most. That's awesome, bro. Can and, I get you behind the camera like one last time? Yeah, bro? I mean. It's for your channel, but it's just nice to. Yeah, do that. Because like, I don't even have to think. It's just like super smooth. I'll be like, hey, there's Jason. <laughs> Dang, man. 
It's gonna be weird. It's gonna be weird uh, have, not having you around, uh, having that nice positive energy, uh, despite you know. And you know, like we talked about this before off camera, that whenever we ever want to link up, whether it's an AC doing dumb things. Hold on, my mom's calling some other say that I should probably answer. Okay, sorry. Yeah, so many interruptions. Jeez. Hey, you're like hour and a half away, so I mean, if you ever want to do the drive or whatever. Mind the drive. Yeah. You want to get hit by a car as a clown again? You know? <laughs> Can I literally He's... get hit by a car as a clown? Like, yeah, you probably <laughs> wouldn't that. do it now. I feel like you're mm, a bit older. I do. Come enough. on, let's see. I've gone in a lake for MVE. Right. I, cold. Uh, I don't know that you got hit by a car. No. Are you still I, down to do the crazy stunts? I mean, I just got like myself ran into a tree and hit the That's ground true. pretty hard. That's true. That's true. I was... ate dog poop. I tried doing a front flip and failed and basically right. broke my shoulder. All right. Maybe you still got it. Maybe you still got mm -hmm. it. You can stop, man. All right. I mean, if you ever do need the drones, they'll mail uh... it. Yeah. I might. I destroyed one. Yeah. So, I mean, yeah, yeah. Tech. RIP oh, drone. <laughs> but guys, um, I'm gonna just, you know. I'm gonna close off the vid. Well, I think what I'm gonna do is kind of roll a montage of. Uh, oh, that's some, cool. I like that. Yeah, some, yeah. Some funny moments we had, uh, whether it's from stuff on your channel or here on like the this channel. the best of? Yeah. Or the, nah. Sorry, Uncle Larry's <laughs> ears. <laughs> but uh, thank you guys all so much for watching. I hope you guys. Had a fantastic day. Had that smile on your face. If you guys enjoyed the video, do me a favor. Drop a like on it. Hit that subscribe button. Check oh, out yeah, the Dragon Nuggets. Hit, hit the subscribe for those uh, watching for because they saw me in the video thumbnail or whatever. <laughs> like, clickbait. This Swift's last day or whatever. But uh, guys, drop a subscribe if you love Swift's camera work over the year or two and also liked him as a personality because this will be pretty much one of the old few ways yeah. you'll be able to see Swift. So... Because you won't see him on the McDuggan Nuggets channel anymore. So make sure you drop a subscribe, click the post notific notification bell, follow him on his socials, see him on Twitch streaming, and yeah. also uh, make sure you follow him on, on Storyfire because uh, I think I think he definitely should get a series. Uh, it makes him more that, money than that'd be, YouTube. That would be oh. fun getting the upload. Uh, wait, I, I, I think I slipped I one think, in there, I think, dude. I think that just got like the audio just went mute for a second. Yeah. I, don't, I don't know why. Yeah, it's <laughs> weird. <laughs> but thank you guys all so much for watching. Until next time, it's been your boy Jeff. Keeping it real. I'm going to log out. I'm going to peace out. And well, we're going to do the... Do the, the original one. Yeah, I saw your girlfriend do it. I was like, dude, I want to do it. Are right, you ready? <laughs> pa, 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 pa. Peace. <laughs> was that too early? Nah, right, you, you're, you're, All right, you're, see you guys. You're good. Uh, should, bye, should bye. we actually hug real quick and then? Yeah, let, let's just. <laughs> dude, when you hug more than once, it becomes yeah, all right, a little go, weird. Go ahead, go, all right, go peace, ahead. guys. All right. First order of business, Aww. guys. Congratulations to Swift UAV for winning the MJN Cameraman Competition. Thank you. Congrats, bro. Appreciate it. So we actually just signed him on for the next year. He is a part of Rigid Studios. I mean, it doesn't have to be a year. If he messes up, it's gonna end up. Ah, she looks so young. Man, Jesse, you really worked him to death, didn't you? It shows in it. I'm just kidding. No, I'm just kidding. Nobody does a year. Months or something. <laughs> but I'm committing to Swift. And guys. A lot of you guys are probably wondering, no way. Was that rigged? Yes, that part of the series Swift winning? No. 100% legitimate. I didn't want Swift to win. No, he, I, he told me numerous times, <laughs> I dare not pick Swift. I, <laughs> I made that abundantly clear. I didn't want this guy to win. He proved me wrong. He earned his stars and stripes. Guys, he had the two best scenes. Scene number two and scene number eight, Russian Roulette and the Ice Cream Man. Which a lot of you guys uh, have picked yeah. in the comments. Yeah, so you guys can't be mad. He did have the best camera work. So you can play it on camera. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I love this. I've like used it for a montage. They went back. Oh my god. How is that? <laughs> Gotta sign my life away, aka Jesse's car away. Oh, sign yeah. here, date here. Uh, yeah, let's just do it. Here. Oh my god. Dude. Oh wow. This is awesome. Yo. It actually came out really nice. So, what the hell are you doing here, dude? I'm here. I want my job back, Jesse. Just give me one more shot. I don't, dude, I don't need you to do what I already do myself. I can film myself. Yeah, dude, yeah, I can't I believe you. No, 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 dude, dude, dude. I can't believe you come all this way. You put me in a spot here, man. Yes, Let me prove it to you, Jesse. Dude, come on, dude. I mean, we talked, dude. You, we know Corn and Park were better. No, dude, he's got personality, man. That's what you need. Dude, I think he's, because technically the net worthless, I think he's like one of the top, that would make him one of the top 1,000 like richest people in the world. Yeah. Oh, what I didn't see that. Dude, I actually I did not watch that. Like, people all say, like, money will bring happiness. I, I honestly did, like... You now have more money than Bill Murray.
Something. All I know is my mom, if you ever see this, just at the end of the day, thank Jesse. Don't thank me, dude. I just oh played a lottery ticket. Just not that, but like you, you've always helped me out so much. You just changed our lives. Like I'm gonna make sure my brother and sister's out of college debt, so my brother doesn't have to work at Best Buy to follow the film route that he wants to do. God. <laughs> you guys are such assholes. <laughs> I love you, man. Just love you, too, bro. I'm thankful for everything you've done. I'm thankful for you being stepping up, being the cameraman for the last year. We made a lot of good stuff together, and hope you know whatever comes next is uh, is what's best for you. Yeah. And you know, man, just follow your heart. Yeah, man. Just know the path for you is always gold. Tell your future boss. I said, what's up? <laughs> tell him. That might be me, I guess. <laughs> yeah. Tell tell whoever you're working for next that like this was it was better with. This was better, right? <laughs> it was. Okay, I was saying. Oh, the, wait, is that it? Okay, they go to the this song mm. well I thought there would be more I guess I was kind of expecting a little more I mean I got like a little bit of a teary eye but I didn't I didn't get I didn't bald my eyes or anything I think the reason why I bald my eyes out so much in Jesse's video which I I guess like I was hiding it kind of like in my reaction um, but I was like really choked up when I was watching that video and I think the reason why I, I was so choked up is because of the things that Jesse was saying. Like, like what his words were, like, like breaking my heart because, like, all the pain and stuff that Jesse had gone through with everyone corn and then with Swift leaving and everything, like, the truth came out on how Jesse felt. And it was heartbreaking to hear, like, all the pain that he was um, expressing as the devil. And it was just, like, it's like, oh my god, like, I, like I had, it's almost like I had no idea he felt that strongly. Like, I knew he was upset about, like, with Corn and with Swift, but I didn't know how strongly he felt about it all, and it, it's a, it's a big thing. It's, it's really painful for him, and that really made me, like, really upset, like, because, yeah, like I said, I care about Jesse. Um, and also, I hate that Swift is leaving, too. I don't, and, like, him being such, like, a genuine person, like, it's hard to find people like that in this world, and he honestly is a genuine person, so is Jesse, and, like, them together is just, like, perfect. <laughs> so, it's like, it's like, it's like, I don't, I still don't know why he has to leave, because if he, because it's almost like if he feels that strongly, like, why is he leaving? Like, I understand, you know, he wants to, um, you know, pursue his own thing, but then it's like, well, if you... Like, why not with Jesse? I mean, like, there's no, there's nothing wrong with creating some things, some wonderful things together. I mean, like, it's almost like Jesse, yeah, it's his channel, but it's almost like, but without, without Swift, it's like not the same. Like, cause he brings, like, uh, it's almost like, remember when Corn during the Psycho series and everyone like loved Corn? Um, because he brought a certain something to the videos, like he did. Swift is also brought something to the videos too. Um, but I think that's even deeper than like Corn and Jesse. I think I don't know because I think like their personalities 
fit better. Um, and they're like friends for life and they could be partners for life, like working partners and stuff. And it's just, it's just disappointing that, um, that, that, that friendship is going to break. Um, not friendship, but I mean like that partnership is going to break. And when like this thing could be the best thing for both of them for the channel. Um, and maybe Swift will be back. I hope he'll come back. Um, maybe not, but maybe he will. We'll see. So I'm really hopeful for the future. And I mean, I guess it really does seem Swift is ready to move on, but I, I don't know why. <laughs> I don't know why he had such a perfect thing going with, with Jesse and, and I know it could be hard working for Jesse, I'm sure, at times, but, you know, like, all good things come with suffering. And so the end result is much better than, like, it's worth the suffering. So, I mean, if, you know, working with Jesse sometimes, which I know it's hard working with him, I think, uh, from what I've heard and stuff. So, anyway, um, I'm going to miss Swift a lot, and I love you, Swift, and, um... Yeah, so I hope you guys watch this reaction, Jesse and Swift. And um, yeah, but I will continue watching your videos, Swift. I don't, I might not always react to them because there's just so many videos to react to on Jesse's side, but I definitely will want to, especially now that you have the girlfriend, and that's always really interesting. <laughs> so, um, anyways, yeah, um, and I hope to see you on Storyfire. So, uh, yeah. So, if you guys want to subscribe to me, you can. I'll put the link in the description. You guys can subscribe. Um, wait, did I just say that? I'll put the link in it. What am I saying? If you want to subscribe, I'll make some more, more reactions. If you want to follow me on Twitter, I'll put that link in the description. And I guess that's it for now. Thanks so much, and I'll see you in the next reaction.